and the swords just keep on coming. It's great to see them everywhere. As far as we look on this coastline, there's pockets spread all over the show, with main shoals still coming up on the southern part of the south coast. They're still fairly far out at Port Edward, but it looks like we can expect quite a bit of swords to come through. Saturday morning, everybody waited in anticipation for the first news on where the swords are being netted. Normally we join the netters because that's where the sharks will follow close in shore and even game fish. Now it's believed that if you can get some of the good sorts off the first batch that is the best possible bait to have and if you're there at the right time you can do just that. Now the sea was quite big at Pumula where the first net were netted which made it very difficult for the netters. There was also a big bank in the back which didn't allow the sharks or any fish to come over. Unfortunately there wasn't much action there and everybody waited around for updates on news of where the sardines are netted elsewhere. Soon after that we got reports of Port Shepston and drove down quickly to see what's happening there. Dean and Linton was quickly on the beach and put baits out to see if they can get any action. They stayed till the sun went down and unfortunately not much action there either. I think it's safe to say that over the next week at least we can still expect quite a bit of action if the weather holds. So make sure you subscribe to the channels to receive regular updates.